Dream. The word dream has many meanings. Let me give you some examples. The first one is to sleep and have pictures happening about things that are going on. Or, during class, suppose you're sitting there and you're bored and you're dreaming about becoming a butterfly. And then the teacher says, hey, hey, pay attention. Are you ready to work? And you say, oops, okay, I'm going to pay attention. Or another meaning is something that you want to become in the future, like work as a teacher at a school for the deaf. Snooze. Snooze has many meanings. I'm going to give you some examples. When you're sound asleep and the alarm goes off and you reach over and you hit the button that lets you continue to sleep. Or, suppose you're watching a movie and the movie is playing on and on and it's so boring and you're so tired and your eyes begin to close and you're having to fight to stay awake to watch the movie. Thump. Thump has many meanings as well. Let me give you some examples. Suppose there's an elephant walking and with each step he makes a loud noise. Or when somebody flicks you with their finger. Or it could be when a kid falls on someone else. Bump. It has multiple meanings. An example could be one car running into another, or suppose you're running along and your head runs into something and you get a bump on your head, or when kids are running and they run into one another. Break. It has many meanings. Suppose you have a toy, a doll, and its head comes off. Oh, no. Or, for example, suppose you have a phone and you're trying to call your parents because it's an emergency and it's not working. Or another example is spring break. When you're in school and you want school to hurry up and finish because you want to leave and go have fun. And finally, it's time to be off on spring break and take off and have fun.